activity for teaching future tenses in the ESL classroom, expected achievements at a point in the future. Moving on from something we will be doing at some point in the future, we can also talk about what we will have done by a point in the future, by using the future perfect tense. This is often used when planning careers or life achievements, by this time next year, I will have finished all my exams. It's also acceptable to use other modal auxiliary verbs here instead of will, such as should, might, or may. An enjoyable activity that works well with this, is to set students up in small groups to invent an extremely successful future career for themselves, for example as musicians, politicians, or travelers. Examples of what to aim for could be, musicians, by this time next year we'd have signed a contract with a recording company. In two years time we will have performed in many countries around the world. A good way to use this is for each group of students to have exactly the same role, and get them to describe their future careers to the class in the most optimistic and ambitious way. Thanks so much for watching. We are ITTT, the leading provider for TEFL and TESOL training courses. If you like this video, please subscribe by clicking the button down here and click on any of the videos here on the left for more interesting teaching tips for getting certified to teach English abroad and online.